Right, welcome to part three of the Let's Play of Streets of Rage 2 Extreme Edition. Um, and that was a bad start. Holy shit! Oh my god, it's the wankers who don't know how to use a knife, and they're everywhere, and they're raping me. Oh my god! I do not like... I do not like this level at all. Oh, wow. Wow, that was, that was appalling. I really really did not know how to deal with those knife guys there. Oh. <laughs> I'm not looking forward to the later levels. Oh. Okay. We're going to forget that happened. We're going to play properly now. Come here, fatties. Let me salvage your blubber. I will sell it on the black market. Yes. What? They didn't even... Oh my god, there was an, there was an apple there. As well as that awful star. I don't even get the apple that I deserve. Oh my god! That's two lives already. Unbelievable. You can just piss right off, and so can you. Look at that, he's trying- His Godolkin is so pathetic it can't even smash the wooden crate, and- And there we go, there's the apple, but it's a bit bloody late now, although I still need it. So, I'm not gonna be- I'm not gonna complain in case it sort of decides that I actually don't deserve it, and then it decides to disappear. Gold bars and wooden crates seems legit. But yeah, there's a- uh, I was going to say, before I got absolutely pummeled, that there's no slow boom playing in the background, there's that other tune, and you- Oh my god, the kickboxes! Barbon already? Really? Um, yeah, you're not supposed to come till later on. Yes, style points there. Oh, this one's called Wayne! Wayne! Better not mess with this guy, because he's called Wayne! I do apologise if any of my viewers are called Wayne. It's quite an amusing name though. I can talk. I'm, I've got a stupider name than that. I mean, well, my first name's okay, but my surname? I mean, Stungo, really? That just confuses everyone. No one ever knows how to pronounce it. Everyone call, would call me Stungo. I mean, how is it Stungo? It's not double O, there's a U in it. Anyway, I'm talking about completely irrelevant stuff while trying to kill these kickboxes. Raven. Yeah. Oh, what? Just took me right out of the air then. Okay, that tactic doesn't work. That does. It's okay. We've only lost two lives before we got to the roof, and I'm probably going to lose about a hundred more because of the bloody jet fighters. Yeah, come here, Mac. Don't you dare do that throwy thing on me where you launch me in the air because that's what kills me. Oh, wow. All right. No, <laughs> don't ruin it now. Come on. Yes! Oh, I was trying to knock him out of the sky with that. No, and uh, no, I'm dead again. Three lives. Oh, and that's a game over. Should we change characters just to entertain the viewers? While well, I'm talking to myself here. Yes! Continue. Let's play as Blaze. Because she's sexy. And she has cool throws. Oh, she doesn't have infinite knees. What a poor choice. <laughs> oh well. I'm sure she has some other uh, redeeming features. She can deal with these bloody jetpack guys. Oh yes, you can't even throw those, I forgot, because then they just sort of... Oh, stop it. They just look... Yeah. Well, they don't land on the ground, because... At least her special attack lasts for longer, so it has, like, more... Oh, wow, that was awful. Okay, if I can finish the sentence, it has more invincibility frames, uh, which is kind of useful in a scenario like this. Uh, but I... Oh my god. There we go. Yes. Take... No, that's another life down the drain. Oh, off the edge of the boat. <laughs> As this scenario... Oh, for goodness sake, stop it. That's just getting tiresome now. I mean, I, I just don't know how to deal with these guys. I mean, I've watched, like, countless videos of people showing perfect ways of beating them. But as if I'd ever pay such close attention. Oh, my... I'm not even making sense anymore. Oh, what? Why is everything slowed down? Was that a boss fight? Um... Oh. That was weird. It slowed down like it does when you kill a boss, but then it carried on saying go. Yeah, so, well, at least I get to deal with some bikers who... Well, that... Yeah. Bikers who are apparently just as bad because they kill me as well. I'm trying to work out what else Blaze can do, which is different from a uh, regular Streets of Rage 2 counterpart. Ow! No, no, no slapping. Whoa! 
Did you see that? Because I sure didn't, because he just turned into a blur in front of my eyes. Yeah. I have random Godolkins as well. Ah! Well, actually, I use both hands. They just don't go very far. Actually, I think she says Kikolcha, which is like one of Chun-Li's moves. But this definitely came before that, because that wasn't introduced until the Alpha series, where there were supers. Actually, I can't remember now. I know, there were, there were supers in uh, well, one of the editions of Street Fighter 2, but there was no, it wasn't that one, it was... Oh, I don't know what I'm talking about anymore. And I've lost another continue. Wow. What a joke. I think I'm going to go back to Axel, because otherwise I'm not even going to make it to level 6. There we go. And as soon as I spawn, I get thrown. You know what? There's something inherently impolite about just randomly slashing someone. It really is. Yeah, I like that. Just, just don't do it, okay? It's not how you make friends. But this is... Well, that is if your friend has a death wish. Oh, joy of joys. The boss fight. I don't know what I did there. I was trying to time it so I hit them all with the Grand Upper and I just epically failed. Oh, no, don't. No, just, 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 just don't. I'm not even going to tell you what not to do, just don't, okay? Just don't. No Grand Uppers either, that's my move, you fat boxer. No, I didn't mean to do that. And it just cost me dearly. How hilarious. Yeah. Deep throw. I might make it to the next level. I've only got one life. Oh wow, okay. Well, there we go. <laughs> that was stage five and I, I've got a feeling that I'm gonna get game over on stage six and uh, <laughs> you know, have to use the options menu thing to continue from there. I'm literally gonna be using a, a whole set of continues on every single stage or I might even have to turn my lives up. But you know what? If it means I can get through this hack, I suppose that's all that matters. And we're now on the beach. What's so threatening about a beach? Oh, I'll tell you. Ninjas! Bloody loads of them. What are they doing on the beach? Then again, I should have I asked what they were doing on that pirate ship earlier. Maybe it's landed now. Or come in. Okay. Sort of getting some fair trades for hits there, while well, I'm hitting them, all they're hitting me. No. Good lord. I say, that was just rather inconvenient. Right. I've got a knife thing. Yeah. You gutton. Take that. Charge up some double kicks here. Yeah. Didn't like that in apples. Coward. Blocking everything. Oh, what the, 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 you can't hit me from off the screen. That's even worse than. <clears throat> How many of these actual bastards are there? Doesn't matter, I'll just grand up all of them. And uh, I do like how when he kicks me out of the air, it makes the same noise that the metal pipe makes. That's fairly amusing. Oh well, I can't blame them, you know, Mega Drive's carts don't have room for that many sound effects. They have to be efficient. Grab the chicken before we waste another life. Ah! Kicks over again. Come here. What, what is that? Leaping forward with your knee outstretched, yes. Yet again, more insane battle tactics. But it doesn't matter because they're like six and a half feet tall kickboxers so they can do what the hell they want. I mean, how come those guys don't take as much damage when they block, but the bosses do? These guys might as well be the bosses. Come on. Just just let me get close enough to get some infinite knees. Hey! We like the infinite knees. Smashed. Stop stuttering. Do not pay for this. Got an apple there. Don't need it yet, but I probably will do rather soon. Kaku. Sounds like a bloody bionicle. Just a bit of leisurely stomach crippling there. 
Oi. That's all I'm gonna say. Oi. Yes, ya to you too. You can tell I'm just sort of acting rather defeatist right now. I just kind of know that I'm going to lose horribly. <sighs> Sadness. Yeah. Dude, the Dan imitators aren't too bad compared to the kickboxers. I really hate them. Line up for your throwing and then slide tackle me because I get complacent. Cockackle. You are a potato. That is all. Why signal? Do your signaling call. Make sure you signal to the Y, otherwise you might get run over by the impending bikers. Yeah, you like that? Clearly not, because you're getting raped, and so am I. I'm horribly outnumbered. Ouch. I swear their hands double in size when they try slapping you. That was cheap. Then again, so am I infinite knee combos, but I don't care. Right then. Ow. I'm not looking forward to the boss fight. I've got to deal with those jetpack wankers at the same time. Is the claw dude and bikers? What fun! And grenades, bikers with grenades. What more could a man want? It's okay. Just take it easy. My upper lip is itching, and I can't take my hands off the controller right now. It's okay. That gave me a chance. So I didn't want to pause it. I just thought, yeah, I'll let someone knock me over, and then I'll get whipped. Electric whip. Nah. Yeah. The pipe is mightier than the whip. <sighs> Big exaggerated exasperating sigh. Nah. I'm going to stab someone. That is game over. That is the actual over of the game. But I'm not quitting there. Yes, Axel. Ah. No, I will uh, rejoin you next time when I start from level 6 again with all of my continues intact and uh, probably not get to the end of it anyway, but hey, we'll see how it goes. Thanks for watching.